Father, we need you. 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 More than ever. Father, we need you. More than ever. Father, we need you. 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 More than ever. Father, we need you. More than ever. They named us Generation X. Hmm. Why is that? Could it be X marks the spot? Hmm. The chosen generation to break generational curses seems to be legit. That seems to have unfolded in my own life. I was considered to be Generation X. Yep, I come from Generation X. That's what they named it. That's what they named my generation, Generation X. X marks the spot. Hmm. Thus far, I posted two videos speaking on the second exodus and how it hasn't happened yet. And there's a video that I was tagged in. I was just tagged in this video. Message for the nation. Rejoice. Oh, yes. Because I believe that this is connected. This is tied into... This this video right here that I clicked on to watch an urgent message from the Holy Spirit must watch confirmation. Check this out. This is by Big Levi. And yeah, I, I seen them before along with Big Judah and Ali Al and all of them. Uh, man, I, I honestly believe that the second exodus is coming. And the reason why is because this scripture right here has been in my heart for a, a while, man. And no, it's like the reason that I brought forth those videos about the second exodus. But anyway, it says, uh, and this is Jeremiah chapter 23, verse 7. Therefore, behold, the days come, says the Most High, that they shall no more say, The Most High liveth, which brought up the children of Israel out of the land of Egypt. But the Most High liveth, which brought up and which led the seed of the house of Israel out of the north country and from all countries, whether I had driven them, and they shall dwell in their own land. That hasn't happened yet. That 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 scripture has not happened yet. And let me go to this video right quick. Check this out. Will be so powerful. We're talking about brother. Keep going. As I begin to breathe on the breathe on the seed of faith that is in you, it will be very quickly. It will become a great harvest, both in the natural and in the spirit realms. Yes. Yes, brothers, both in the natural realm right now and in the spiritual realm. Those people never talk about spiritual realm. That is what these men that are talking right now. This is not him, brothers. This is not this man. You can watch him. This is not a uh, uh, Christmas. This is not. And then the message is not for uh, his church. The message is for us. Say it, God. They just Notice don't know. my faithful sons and daughters. I am now coming quickly and my reward yeah. is with me. Yes, he's coming quickly, Isaiah 60, 22. In his time, I will hasten.
For the next four years, what you're going to see me do will be so powerful and miraculous that you will forget the pain and the sorrow that you have gone through from the battles of the past. Yes. Father, say from 2020, brothers, to 2024, he's going to do a hitch that you will forget about Jacob's trouble, brothers and sisters. Hallelujah. That you means that that's going to be the second exodus. It has to be. So you say, since we... What happened to us? If something did happen to us, brothers, this prophecy that Father sent us, he said, you haven't seen nothing yet. What I'm about to do in the four years, okay, from 2020 to 2021, we already went, we almost went one year into it, okay? We almost done until March. And then the rest three years, brothers and sisters, like the beloved brother Big Judah been saying it, Elder Ayah been saying it, 2024, from those four years, brothers, buckle up. This last, last outpouring of my glory will be filled with the faith of Abraham, the praise of David, the purpose of Elijah, the favor of Job, the protection of Esther, the boldness of Peter, and the revelation given to John. Yes, brothers, I'm going to let this place for a little moment. Read and listen to this with the spiritual mind. Understand Man, this message it sounds so like the second you, exodus to me. Nothing. This final outpouring of my glory in the earth will be indescribable and undefinable. Everything that I'm going to do, this generation has not seen up until this time. In the next four years, I'm going to touch every nation on the earth. And when my glory is released from my Father in heaven, it will not just start in one nation, but it will be released at the same time all over the Earth. Oh yes! Hi, <laughs> yes. Yes, you did. Yes, you did. <coughs> when Father, sorry, I, I said I was not gonna do an interrupt that. Yes, you did. When Father uh, unleashes glory in March 2020, or oh, you really see even even before that, because Father don't go by years and stuff. He go by oh, his yeah, own time. It's already here, when baby. He his glory, it's power, already been here. Cover all late nation. <coughs> okay, the railroad, the sorrows, the templates of the apocalypse of Abraham. Let's move in, brothers. Just when you believe that you understand this last great move of God, I will shift and I will change. Ooh. Just like we thought 2020 was like the best the most what? I can bring. There you go. It's going to he shift. will shift and bring change. I am uh, no, he don't change. That all I have done in the earth at one time. To some, they will see me as the line of Judah. To others, they will see a lamb. Yes. One moment, it will look like a revival, healing of sickness and disease. Yes. Yet the next moment, it will look like the outpouring on the day of Pentecost. Yes. This will not be controlled by man, and it will not be ended by man. You you got that right. You wow. got that right. You can't stop this. The men are not doing this. The elite are not doing this. Fathers doing this. Hallelujah. Yes. <laughs> now, I am now becoming all things to all men. To one I will be a blessing, but to the other I will be a curse. Oh, you wow. got that right. Well, yeah. You got that right. But he doesn't change. Fathers are a blessing, and to you is a curse. This is the father's change. This is the Gentile tribulation. No longer will the counterfeit church profit for who I am. Yes. For I have stood in silence and watched my name be profited for sin yes. and for ungodliness. But know this, saith the Lord, I lift my hand off of every house that yes. barred me from their door that would not let me be moved in the midst of my people, but only yes. use my name for their own profit yes. and their own moving forth in their own visions but now this last release of god's glory is being initiated by the almighty father in heaven for the father is now preparing the bride for yes. the son jesus christ this day saith god i release a dowry as the father of jesus unto his bride and that which has been precious to me i now release to you for the bride will not marry the master without having possessions of her home 
See, I told you! I told you the second Exodus would come before. I told you the second Exodus will come before the Messiah. That, that That's what was in my spirit. Like, the second Exodus would have to happen first. The only reason I, I knew that was because I read in the Dead Sea Scrolls, the War Scroll, and all of that. It was after both sides were equal. This was toward the end, the Apocalypse War. Toward the end, both sides were equal. Both had, had three, like three wins, three losses, whatever. And then the Hamashiach came. But we were already at peace. We were in our land without walls and all of that. We were at peace. And, and that I believe that that is about to happen, bro. That is like so strong in my spirit. I feel it. I feel it. I feel it, and I was trying to tell my mom, I'm like, the second exodus has not happened yet. The second exodus is still to come. Like, man, I really hope that it is, bro. And it just makes sense to me. It clicks. It's like, why would he allow these devils to get us now that he's woken us up in the land of our captivity? If he took the time to wake us up in the land of our captivity and put within us his laws, his commandments, his statutes, his judgments, and he unplugged our ears, and he, he unblinded our eyes, and he showed us his ways, and we, the, those of us that heard his voice and chose to follow, man, why, why would he allow these devils to inject us with their concoction forcefully? Are you kidding me? Are you like, are you serious right now? They probably are going to try. Oh, they, they got their military all ready to go. Did they, did, is this not what they said? You know, as I was listening to them, I'm just like, <laughs> I'm just like sitting there just watching. Like, okay. Oh, so, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. You got tanks and yeah, come on. Oh, so you, you really think you can do something, you know? Well, I'm not scared in the least bit. Not one time was I afraid <laughs> because, you know, I'm a little concerned for them. <laughs> like, uh, like, are, son, are you are you thinking right? <laughs> are, are you serious right now? You can't be serious. <sighs> Bro. I don't see any other way like how the father would allow I don't see any way how the father would allow that to happen to us I don't see him allowing them to take us to a concentration camp and prove us you know I just I don't see that happening because we have been going through torture, trauma, and for centuries, bro. You know, they were torturing people. They were burning us alive. They were calling our people witches. Those were the ones that they called pagans and witches because we wouldn't give up worshiping the almighty creator to adopt their religion. They were forcing our people to adopt religion. First, it was Islam. Then it was Christianity. People don't even understand, man. Religion is bondage. The whole world is, is about to see this. The whole world is about to witness the power of the Most High. And I'm, it's like, man, I'm on the edge of my seat with some popcorn, bro. Like, I'm ready. I'm seriously ready. I'm ready because the heavens and everything was silent. They were all silent in the heavens, man. And the earth was allowed to just do what it do. These evil ass people were allowed to just do what they do. For a time, time and half a times, they were allowed to do what they were going to do. But now, now this is changing, baby. It's changing and the wheels are turning, man. We had the conjunction. 
Like, it let us know in the stars in the sky, man. It, it literally, seriously, like, the signs and the wonders of the sky, the sun, the moon, and the stars, man, they give for a sign. And they gave these signs, bro. They've been giving these signs since, like, 2016. Woo! The Spirit of the Most High. Man, he's turned his eyes back to his people, bro. Like, <laughs> there's no way that he will wake up his people in the land of their captivity and pack them full of his truth and knowledge and wisdom just to have these devils kill us. Yeah, right, bro. <laughs> uh, I'm a little concerned for them. Like, honestly, you know. Are you serious? You gonna take on the most high almighty power? Alright, you got some nerve. Wickedness was allowed to reign for a time, man. And that time has come to an end. The Gentiles' time has come to an end. Now is recompense, man. Now the earth is about to be purged of these evil people. And it's about time. You know how much innocent blood that's been crying out from the earth to the Father? The angels been asking the Father, like, how long, Father, how long will thou not have mercy upon Judah and Jerusalem and all of her cities? The second exodus is coming. And the whole world is going to see it. I think it's tied in. It's connected to all of this what's going on. Them trying to clamp their grip on humanity. <laughs> they're taking all of their freedoms and they're just falling in line, man. Like sheep led to the slaughter. Just... Follow in line. Follow one after another. Get your vaccine. No, not me. Not me. Mm -mm. Well, he woke me up and told me I'm a chosen one. Set apart. A hidden one. Anyway, I ain't going to stay on here. I did want to get the rest of that. Because he was going off. Dude, it's seriously going off. This is my first time watching it. I clicked on it just a little bit ago when I seen I was tagged in it. Ugh. It cover all late nation, okay? The war world, the sorrows, the templates of the populace of heaven. Let's move on, brothers. Just when you believe that you understand this last great move of God, I will shift and I will change. No, he Just like we thought 2020 was like the best the most I can bring, he don't then he is going to shift and bring more. I am now releasing but that's the promise that all I have done in the earth change. at one time. To some, they will see me as the line of Judah. To others, they will see a lamb. Yes. One moment, it will look like a revival, healing of sickness and disease. Yes. Yet the next moment, it will look like the outpouring on the day of Pentecost. Yes. This will not be controlled by man, and it will not be ended by man. You got that right. You got that right. You can't stop this. The men are not doing this. The elite are not doing this. Fathers doing this. Hallelujah. Yes. <laughs> now, I am now becoming all things to all men. To one I will be a blessing, but to the other I will be a curse. You got that right. You got that right. Fathers are a blessing, and to you is a curse. This is not Esau's not trouble. Not this is the Gentile tribulation. No longer will the counterfeit church profit for who I am. Uh, yeah, I don't play into that Esau is the Gentile type mess. That's retarded. Esau is Semitic. But know this, saith the Lord, I lift my hand off of every house that barred me from their door, that would not let me be moved in the midst of my people, but only yes. use my name for their own profit and their own moving forth in their own 
own visions. But now this last release of God's glory is being initiated by the Almighty Father in heaven. For the Father is now preparing the bride for yes. the Son, Jesus Christ. This day saith God, I release a dowry as the Father of Jesus unto his bride. And that which has been precious to me, I now release to you. For the bride will not marry the master without having possessions of her home. Because the bride 100. will be without spot, wrinkle, or blemish. The men and women that God is going to use will not have sin. Yes. Yes, you got that right. We will not have sin, brothers. Yeah. Pray, repent. Let's keep moving. In their lives, I will uncover those that have crouched their sin and have covered it and have moved in gifts. This move is not about the gifts yes. in men's lives, but it is about the righteousness and the relationship of God Almighty. Right. For demons are not moved by gifts, but demons are moved by holiness, says the Lord. And this move is a move of holiness and yes. not of gifts. These That's men why will not seek their own abstinence. glory. Yes. yes, they will not fail. We will no not sexual lose impurity. God in past decades declined and came to an end because many of the people that God used who started in the spirit ended in the flesh. For though they were humble at the beginning, they could not handle the glory and the honor that came with it. You got that right. You got that right. The many of us that the Mosai. Uh, begin with us and then we begin the glory and the spiritual and then we get it in the flesh man yeah. we profane the Mosai we bought and we keep talking about Esau's uh, Jacob trouble Jacob trouble you're gonna be real you're gonna be, we forgot the message but this generation that the Mosai raised up right now we will not fail keep going not this time, says the Lord of hosts, <laughs> the men and women that I am now raising yes. up. I have invested years yes. in preparing them wow. for this time. Yes. Many of them wow. have thought that I have forgotten them, says oh, the Lord. Wow. But I have not. I refuse to use old wineskins who are not able to flow oh. in the spirit. Oh. There are many ministries that though they have been profitable, oh, I'm my moving God. away from them because and I'll they feel that spirit. And could they could not change because they refused wow. to look at new books. They refused to look at the past. Yeah. They refused to look at new information. They refused to do what the Mosai tell them to do. They stake in one book, 166. Yes. Okay? They don't want to do anything else. Right. They don't want to read They want to believe everything the that they were taught. They profane the Mosai. The Mosai say, hey, man, okay, no more. This new generation, this, this last people that we are raising up. They don't want to let go of right their now, beliefs. That's it. To the men and women whom I have put in the fire of testing and purifying for years, because you have remained faithful to me. Yes, Father, purify those men and women with the burial, the angels of fire. Clean our soul. That's what I tell I've my been people. Baptized with fire. Okay, the first purification you have I'm to call on side to send the burial to burn your spirit, burn everything, purify you. Okay, let's go ahead. In the next four years, you will accomplish more than you have accomplished in your lifetime. Yes, in the four years, brothers and sisters, we are about to accomplish more stuff we ever accomplished in our entire life. Brothers and I'm sisters, I'm already doing it, bro. Bro, this I'm nation completing has taken projects the old like left and, right and the YouTube wise and the gray-headed and stuck that. them on a shelf and they have replaced them with young men who have not been through the fire. I make a covenant promise to you, saith the Lord, that I am reaching back into the house of God and I am touching the Joshua's and Caleb's. Yes. The hoary head, saith God, yes. who have been put on the side Line, but I did not retire you, says the Lord. Yes. They retired you, and you are yeah. not done till I say that you are done. 100. Exactly. The Mosai is the one who tell when to stop and when to go. No man can come over and tell you, oh, stop this. Stop doing that. Stop saying this. Stop Fact. going online. Stop doing this. Stop. The Mosai can do this. I know, says the Lord, that you who are the remnant have suffered greatly over the years yes, for we me do. and my vision to be fulfilled in the earth. Yes, we I do. now make a covenant to you that the reward that I have for you in the world to come is so great that if I showed it to you right now, you would not be able to comprehend. Wow. I keep telling my people this. 
I told them, listen, the most I have stuff for us brothers and sisters. If it show it to you, your soul going to check out of your body, brothers and sisters. We are not ready for what the most is going to bring for us, man. The technology, the blessing, brothers. Brothers and sisters, things that the Mosai beam into our heads, brothers. I, I keep telling you the other day, that's why the Mosai told me to stand down and wait, and wait for him. He showed me a couple of stuff. He said, tell my children, calm down. You guys are trying to go too fast. Calm down. I'm, I'm here. I got stuff for you. Okay? Genesis 15, verse 14. Great substance, brothers. Let's keep going. This is getting good. I feel that. What I have set aside for you, what mankind is now entering into, I call harvest. Because that which every man has sown, he is now going to start reaping. Yes. For many, it will be devastating and grievous. Yes. They will lose all that they have. Yes. But for the faithful, it will be joy, joy. and laughter. Yes. Of the course. days of tear are over. No, Jacob's yes. trouble is over. Jacob's trouble is over, brothers and sisters. You hear it from the mouth of the Holy Spirit. Jacob's trouble is over. It's no more. For the remnant and the days of sorrow have come to an end for the house of God. For I'm getting ready to move in the house of the Lord. And there is no longer a sound of death, but yes. there is a sound of victory. Yes. There is a shout, saith the Lord, that's being released in the house of God. Yeah, the Get house ready, of Israel. Says God, yes. For no longer will your hearts hang on the willow trees. Get them off, says God. Yes. For there is a new song that is now being released yes. in the spirit realm. Of when course. this song is played, say it, God, it will touch the unchurched that and the true. unsaved. Yes. They will say, what is this that we hear? Yes. And God will say, it is the sound of David. For yep. I am now raising up the tabernacle of David so the Lord. Yes. And the seed of David will be lifted up in the midst of praise. Yes. For many, it will be yes. a time of joy, but for others, it will be a time of sorrow. You got that right. You got that right. For us, it will be time of joy. For them, it will be time of sorrow. <laughs> this is the templates of the fathers of Abraham. Fathers, heal, brothers. I'll pour my spirit upon all flesh. We don't know this, brother. We don't know him. I, we clap right. so for brothers. We give it the benefit of the doubt. Right. He's a Gentile. But so far, the way the spirit is moving to the brother, Listen what he's gonna do after the, the message he just walk away. Okay? Wow. Alright. Let's let's go. Let's move in. It is now time, says the Lord, for all men to begin to reap what they have sown. Wow. Got that right. Know this that today the court of heaven yes. has set down to declare heaven's final judgment wow. yes. on this dispensation mm -hmm. called wow. grace yes the gavel has been raised the will of man creator who is god mm -hmm. shall yeah. now be accomplished in the earth yes as it is already in, in heaven. heaven in the spiritual realm. so yes. now the next sovereign action of god is i have ordered angels says the lord to the earth yes to begin removing the spirit of heaviness Yes, from the so, bride of Jesus Christ of course, also for us, yeah. to give the garments of praise yes. to the saints. Yes, and we have to do this. Okay, that's what we've been doing. We've been telling our people, Jacob's trouble is over. Okay, praise to the Lord. Give him all praises, brothers. There will be no Jacob's trouble. This is this is strictly from, from the Mosai, by the Holy Spirit. Mm -hmm. Okay? The fear of the Mosai only Okay, give your life unto him. Don't worry about anything else, brothers. Okay, let's keep moving. Of the most high. Yeah, yeah, since when? There are walls. Listen, listen, listen as let, there were... since when those people use this, this word of, of the most high. Right, Look, right, listen, right. I'm not quite sure if he's reading from right, a book or if he's reading a message. God. I'm not quite brothers. If this come from the book, if if this come from uh, uh the the Bible, I don't know. I haven't done the research. I was so excited. Yeah, there, I, I said I gotta bring this uh, uh, of this message to the to the family. All right, let's go ahead. Shall now be accomplished in the earth, as it is already in mm -hmm. heaven. So now the next sovereign action of God is I have ordered angels, says the Lord, to the earth. To begin removing the spirit of heaviness from the bride of Jesus Christ. Yes. 
and to give the garments of praise to the saints of the Most High. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. You got that right, damn it. Yeah. Those people never talk like that, brothers. Those people never use this word. Those people never stand over there and say the saint of the Most High. Oh, what is this? What was going on here? What's going upon this brother right there? What's going on here? Yes, this is, we have to, the angels are removing the spirit of heaviness. That's why the, the father sent Raphael, okay, so we can stay in the spiritual hospital. He sent Gabriel to strengthen us. He sent Michael to, to track the ley line and give us our power back. Let's move on. There are walls, as there were in Jericho, that many have looked at and said, they cannot be penetrated. But I say to you, there are no walls that hell has raised up in this nation that I am not going to be able to tear down. There are no barriers that will be able to withstand my glory, my power, for my purpose is now going to come to pass in the earth. For the righteous that I'm going to use in this last harvest, I am now binding the spirit of death that it will not touch them. Yes. And the death rate among my people will decline. Yes. But among the wicked, the death rate will increase. Wow. Brothers and sisters, if this is not prophecy, I don't know what that is. Wow. If this is not the Rona, I don't know what that is. If this is not the the, the Esau's trouble, I don't know what that is. No, Father the, say he will protect us. The our Gentiles' trouble. Our de their death rate will increase. Keep going, brother. In 2020, you have saw and watched and heard the wicked try to enforce their evil plans on this nation. Yes. They have sat in the back rooms, hidden while they have formulated the devastation and the end of what I have declared. Yes. But I say to thee at the end tonight that it is over and as 2021 is birthed in the spirit, now you will see the Almighty shut quickly the mouth of the Satan yes. as the world has tried to shut the mouth of the church. Yes. I now shut the mouth of the wicked, saith the Lord, yes. and truth will prevail. Yes. Just as I told Daniel, hallelujah, that after wow. 21 days, thy ready. prayer has been heard, saith the Lord, and the answer is on the way. So now do I declare to you that at the midnight hour when 2021 comes, comes into being that I the Lord thy God say to thee that the prayers that have come up out of this nation yes. are now be received by the hand of the Almighty and I thy God say it to thee that this night heaven is empty of angels because I have loosed him into the earth and the wicked that thought that they were wiser than God the agnostics and the atheists that looked at me and said no no I now in a moment saith the Lord will end your rule and in your reign for I am not done saith the Lord yes. I am not done saith the Lord oh, yes. but I'm just getting warmed up oh, saith yes, the Lord. I have not seen ear hath not heard yes. neither sin into the heart of man yes. the saints that I prepared for the righteous Ooh. so shall saith the Lord I now give you authority saith God yes over the diseases in this nation. Yes. For even as you begin to release the power of the word of the Lord, so will I back thee up. No longer will your prayers be empty. No longer will there be a delay. But while you are speaking and saying, God, I will send the answer before it ever gets out of my mouth. And get I will off of my say hell, God, my hand for such a time as this. I, the Lord, Thy God and still God, I rule the heavens and I rule the earth, and I, saith the Lord, will triumph for thee in this hour, saith God. Yes. Brothers, brothers and sisters, what you just seen here, what you just witnessed here, this is this is the Holy Spirit speak straight to this guy. Since when those guys speak like that. Since when they say things like that, this message is directly for our people, brothers and sisters. Buckle up, man. Brothers and sisters, man, this is just getting started. Those people haven't seen nothing yet. Let's get moving. Hallelujah. Shout to the Lord. Shout to the Lord. Uh -huh. 
That's right. Hallelujah. Yes. The first becomes last. Yes. The last becomes, becomes first. Yes. Brothers and sisters, we listen. have been if on this the is bottom. The first number, the channel. If this is it, look, the Musai is not playing, brothers. This is the message. So the last will be first, and the first last. Brothers and sisters, this is no joke. First shall be last, and the last shall be first. The head will become the tail, and the tail will become the head. That is the way it is, and that's prophecy. We were prophesied to be the tail of all nations. We got casted down to the bottom of the totem pole. The whole world knows it. That prophecy just prophesied. Like it connects to all the prophecies all throughout the scripture, and mainly the scriptures that they took out. Like Baruch. That he's going to put his spirit within us. And we will praise him in the land of our captivity. And we will think upon his name. Yeah. And we will praise him. Yeah. That's happened. That's happened. And he sharpened many of us up. <laughs> like, seriously, spiffied us up from the inside out. Uh, he ain't done with me yet. I'm still a work in progress. <sighs> this is amazing, though. It's amazing. I love this message. Alright, and I'm going to end it there, because frankly, I don't really feel like talking. <laughs> Shalom.